Get insurance from APSA. We will insure almost anything so you can focus on what matters most to you. That's Africanacity. That's APSA. Today, we're super excited because in my star with ASA, this is a show that is not only stopping in Uganda, but we embrace and encompass the whole of Uganda, East Africa, Africa. And now, today, we are moving straight, sweet, <laughs> till Nigeria. We are going to have some fufu, some gari, okay? Because none other than a superstar is with us tonight. He is a model, a commercial model. He is a runway model. Ladies and gentlemen, he is an actor in Uganda. If you want to watch him, just tune into Honorables. You'll get to see him on Pearl Magic Prime and also Pearl Magic, right? And then, ladies and gentlemen, he is an environmentalist. He'll tell us more about that. I will not go so far with that. He is a beauty king. You'll see him by yourself, right? <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, allow me to introduce none other than Obiokwe. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. Let, let me come in there. Kingsley. Yes, Kingsley. Ah, let me come in there. Let's Hi, go. bro. Um, Obiokwe. Obiokwe. Kingsley Obiokwe. That's my name. Charlie. Ah. How far now? Nah? I day. No. Ah day. Ah day. How far, bro? <laughs> you look great, man. Ah, Looking you. fresh. Thank you. Like Thank a you king. So much. Kingsley ah, the man. <laughs> <laughs> How are you doing, man? I'm all good. I'm all good. How is the I'm industry? Good. Okay, you're an actor first and foremost. Tell me more about the acting. Um, it's it's amazing actually. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. I've been acting since I was a child. Okay. I started acting way back in primary school, like mm -hmm. back in 1998. Mm -hmm. So, but um, I I stopped that mm -hmm. and then focused more on my studies. Okay. And, uh, after I left school, mm. graduated from university, mm. um, I started. I I went into Nigerian. Um, the Nollywood okay. that was in 2015. Okay. I did quite a few movies. Then um, mm. we went on something we called um, NYC National Youth Service Corps. Okay. And um, I didn't have the time mm. to do that because after that I got a job. Mm. I started working as the personal assistant to the Commission of Environment. Okay. Yeah, so, but while I was um, in NYC, mm. I was Mr. NYC. Okay. That was in 2015. So mm. I didn't have that time for movies and all until I came to Uganda. Okay. And there. Uh, um, fortunately, I uh, I started working with um, the Honorable TV series, yeah, and it's been amazing. Trust it's me, been amazing. It's a wonderful experience. Being big ups, <laughs> big ups, big ups. Yeah, like amazing crew, the mm -hmm. director, everyone is just okay. fun to work with. So when you came to Uganda, compared to Nollywood, what do you talk of the Ugandan industry, the movie industry <clears throat> in Uganda? The gap is enormous. I'd it's say. a very big gap, right? It's a very big gap. Okay. So, but are we moving thing, towards? Yeah, that's a, uh, the, the good thing about Uganda is that you, you're moving forward. Okay. Okay. You, mm. you you're trying to evolve. You're trying mm. to meet up to what's expected of you in okay. this present age, mm. because we can't be in 2021 and we'll be yeah. watching whatever it is that people are doing mm. to be. To be done as if we're in 1994. 1994. So okay. it's but it's it's going on well. Mm. I'd say it's okay. really improving. It's improving. big time. Okay, big ups to Ugandan industry. Sure. Now, uh, let me ask this: When you look at the Ugandan industry vis-à-vis -vis the Nigerian industry, what do you think has to be improved in the Ugandan film industry to make it even leapfrog further? First, uh, what are we lacking, which we need to add? First, I would say the zeal, the zeal, uh -huh. the zeal to break it down, to make bro. a change. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, first off, the the actors, mm. the, the the directors, okay. the the pro everyone like mm. need to need to change, need to learn. You mm. know, get yourself um, equipped with the with the current, the recent technology required to produce okay. what's what, what the market required at the mm. time. Mm. Because, uh, like I said before, you can't be doing something that's different in 1994. Mm. Um, the actors need to improve in the craft. Mm -hmm. in studying, improving themselves as mm -hmm. a, okay, no, this is where I want to be. This is how I want to present myself as an actor. Mm -hmm. And that would help a lot. Okay. Then, um, of course, the equipment. Yeah. Technology is evolving. It's, yeah. it's something else, honestly. Okay. So we need to I'll, upgrade on the equipment we use. Definitely. Huh? Okay. Most definitely. Okay. Because a good picture sells more, right? Definitely. Perfect. That's, that's, that's the truth. Because mm -hmm. when, when you get to see something, in three seconds, you want to know if you, you would know if you want to see it again yeah. or not. Yeah. So by by beauty. having, of course, by having that okay. um, 
equipment, the technology mm. that you need, mm. you move forward. People okay. will get to have the interest to mm. watch you. Okay. So cool. So um, finally, in the acting sphere, uh, uh, I needed to ask: Do you think um, what you act affects how people see? Like in Hollywood, um, we had a very famous patient, so so cool. <laughs> <laughs> And you know what she used to act every time, uh, the witchcraft, witchcraft. How, how can that, does it affect someone's confidence? And uh -huh. um, how did she go around it? Let me say that, because by then I'm sure you're still okay. that side. The, the thing here is this, mm -hmm. when you're on set, you're on set. When mm -hmm. you're off, you're, you, you're who you are. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Being on set and um, acting a particular character, giving mm -hmm. it all of you, mm -hmm. leaving that character while on set, mm -hmm. it's something very special, mm -hmm. you know, for an actor to be able to deliver. Mm -hmm. But when you're out, mm -hmm. you leave yourself, okay? Mm -hmm. you, 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 you just your own, like, you live your normal life. Mm -hmm. When people see patients also poor mm -hmm. and say, okay, all the witchcraft thing, mm -hmm. nah, it's, it's just who she is on camera because of that's what they want her to portray. Do you have a little history of what she went through? Do you know anything she went through? Of course. Uh -huh, now, uh, can you kindly tell us what did she go through as a challenge? Okay, as a challenge. On people, the streets, um, what people, mm -hmm. people started to liken her character on set mm -hmm. to her person. Oh, okay. These are two different things. Okay. Okay. You, 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 you try to equate who she is on camera mm -hmm. and who she is outside mm -hmm. the camera. Actually, I was having a conversation with a friend this morning about mm -hmm. um, David Craig, the new James Bond. Yeah, yeah. She, uh, um, he wore a pink um, velvet tux mm. and um, for the premiere of mm. um, No Time to Die. Yeah, yeah. And he was talking about um, he shouldn't have worn that, that, mm. and that. I was like, dude, listen, he went for a premiere. Mm -hmm. He is David Craig. Yes. All right? Mm -hmm. He is not on set for 007. Mm -hmm. When you see him on 007, he would dress like James Bond. Uh -huh. Let the man leave. Let him live his life. Yeah, right? let him leave. Okay. You don't expect him to be all black talks everywhere so, he is So they're going. criticizing him for not putting on the attire of James Bond. That's right? the point. No, it isn't. So, so that, 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 mm. that's, that's what I'm trying to say. Mm. Trying to equate um, life on camera and life outside okay. camera. These are two different things. Like, in in one of you act as what? Actually, I act like myself. <laughs> so what's the character in Owner Buzz? Are you? It's you living you. Right? Yeah, I'm living me. Actually. Okay. Yeah, I'm There's no stereotype in Owner Buzz. I'm a Nigerian, mm. and then um, I infiltrated a particular organization okay. just to try and get information okay. and all that, just like a James Bond thing. Yeah. You know, but Nigerian. Perfect. Now, uh, let me ask you a few questions, mm -hmm. Kingsley. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, just uh, I, I'm going to ask you just five. Five quick fire questions, right? Okay. Should I get scared? Don't get scared. <laughs> <laughs> now, Kingsley, if you had a Ugandan musician, female, and you were to go out on a date with her, just for a dinner date, who would that be? Ugandan female musician. Mm, that's quite tricky. Mm -hmm. Because I have um, two, like, I have two Come of on. them. Honestly, Kingsley, you don't need to double deal. Huh? No, no, no. Okay, let, me, let me tell you the reason okay. why it's uh -huh. that way. Um, first off, Sheba is the first African female artist I'm following on Instagram. Okay. She's the very first one. Yeah. And then I like Vinka. I like how Vinka. she says her name like Vinka. Vinka. <laughs> I like that both. <laughs> so okay. uh, um, between the two of them, I. Um, I think I'll go with Shiba. With Shiba. Yeah. I like Shiba. Her songs. I, I like, so I like I can say you're officially a Shiba holic. Yeah, definitely. She's the first African female artist I'm following on Instagram. Oh, wow. The That's very great. first. Wow. So, yeah, I'll go with Shiba. Shiba. I like her music. I, have, mm -hmm. I like her person. I like how confident she is. Okay. You know, portraying who she is, mm -hmm. what she desires, and mm -hmm. what she stands for. Okay. Yeah, I like that. Have you done a music video for her? Not yet. Not yet. Would you love to at one point? Should the time come? Perfect. <laughs> now let's go to the real G's. Who would okay. be that real G you would just go and want as bros, a Ugandan musician whom you'd go out as G's, just bros to chill and have a coffee or something? I like Navio. Navio? Yeah. He's a real G. Yeah, He's a big guy like you. Though. <laughs> I like Navio. I 
I like King Saha. King Saha. Like, okay. There's this song of both of them. Kwangalomu. See, see, see. Kwangalomu. I don't know how to say it, but I like the song. It's not you and King Saha. So okay, it's, okay. I can play that song like 24 hours non stop. Oh, non stop. Yeah. Okay. I don't hear a word. I don't understand the word you you're saying, it. but I just love the song. I'm sure we are. At the moment, we're rolling that song and people are listening to it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And then. Um, uh, if we went to your fridge right now, what are the two things we'd find? Actually, three things we'd find in your fridge. Water. Uh huh. Fruit smoothie. Okay. And um, and banana. And a banana. Yeah. If you were to act a famous film, which character would you prefer to do best? If you're given a chance, a character that actually a character that you wouldn't want to act, what would it be? That I wouldn't want to yes. act. Yes. I um ah oh, damn I would love to act everything of course as know. an actor yeah but that I wouldn't want to act hmm that's tricky I have to it's think it's tricky because like, you I have to be casted so in everything you know? let's do what is the first role that you would really crave to act really crave to act mm -hmm. I wouldn't want to act sex scene you wouldn't want to act I wouldn't want to okay but if it's paying millions of dollars. Well, the is it about the money? Money is the motivation, anyways. Okay. But, um, it's the motivation. Yeah, bro. money is the motivation. Uh -huh. So, with the right price, I think I could consider you could it. Consider. Give yeah. it a second thought. With the right price. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, let's go to this. Um, just quickly, if you have, I'm sure you have a new family in, in Uganda, right? Definitely. Yeah. Now, if there's one one friend of yours whom you'd say. Charlie, if I go to charity, first give me space. Let me offer you to charity. I'll get you back. Who would that be? Just offer for their goodness or for their stubbornness. You say, let us give you out for charity. After that, I'll get you back. Who would that be? He's watching or she's watching. <laughs> who would that be? <laughs> uh, who would that be? Mention that name. I don't know. Well, I don't know. I love my friends here. Like, Just give one? Yeah, I, honestly, I can't give, can give out any of them. I can't. No, they may be good, and you want to give out them. Don't be, don't be so jealous with them. No, when it, when it's when it's personal, mm -hmm. I'm very selfish. Okay, you're yeah, selfish. So then. The, yeah, yeah. So they're all when safe. It, yeah, when it's personal, when yeah. when that thing is is about me, okay, mm. I am I'm very selfish. With okay, that. perfect, no problem. And finally, 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 if you're the president of Uganda. You're in Nigeria, but now you're in Uganda and you become somehow our president. <laughs> what would you offer? Or what would you request to eat? A Ugandan course that you'd oh, say, let me Uganda. eat this as the president. Okay. The first meal I ever had in Uganda is um, Lu um, 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 Pilau and Luombo. Pilau and Luombo. Wow. I like that. That's <laughs> I like that. For chicken, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. I'm not a big fan. I'm uh -huh. more of fish and chicken. That's it. So as a present, what would you request now to eat? You know, um, personally, I, I don't believe uh, um, in having very expensive food, mm. you know, because I believe the best of food are actually cheap. Mm. I'm not against having fancy foods. I'm not mm -hmm. against that. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying that um, you can have the best of meals mm. with something that would be maybe half the price of eating in a very fancy restaurant, hotel, okay. or having a very fancy food. Those are nice, yes, mm -hmm. but I'm a very simple person with food. What would I love be? food a lot. Tell us okay. that simple food. Yeah, I, I'd love to have um, chicken pilau. Matoke. Chicken. Okay. I'm trying so hard to not have <laughs> As a present, you would yeah. have to eat matoke and you see how it feels. Right? No, no, I do eat that, mm -hmm. but not always. I'm trying to learn how to eat it. How to eat matoke. Yeah, yeah okay. I'm trying to cool, learn. Cool, cool, no problem. <laughs> so, um, thank you. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we've just heard from Kingsley Obi. Obi Okwe. Obi Okwe. <laughs> About what he does and what he loves. Now, we're going for a quick challenge. We're going to ask, we're going to play a simple musical challenge as usual. Put music in his ear as loud as it is so that he can't read my lips and then he can't listen to what I'm saying rather. And then we do the same for me and we see who he lose. Just three questions each. And yes, thank you very much. My name is Angel Tony Acer, Prince of the Sun, and we will be right back with Showtime. <laughs>
Yes. Obiokwe. <laughs> Kingsley. The big man says he can beat me in this game. I don't know how sure he is about that, but let's do this. Because when it comes to short time, I got him. We are going to play this music for sure, okay? Okay. I'm going to put music in your ears. Simple. And then we see if you can read what I'm saying. And I'll, you'll do the same to me and we see, right? Okay. We good? Yeah, we good. Charlie. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's okay. Do, it. do you go first or I go first? We have three questions each. I mean three statements each. I think I'm the guest. And remember, say a statement which is not longer than five words. Okay. Okay. So, do you go first? Yeah. Come on. Of course, yeah. I'm the guest. Go I should go first. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. That's loud. Okay. <clears throat> I like rice. I like rice. Oh. <laughs> Did I get you right? Perfect. <laughs> Got it. Yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> that is some form of juju. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, that's good. Mm -hmm. Just play the music. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Let's go. Let's go. Just play the music. Okay, cool. I like your show. Hmm? I like your show. Huh? That's twice now. Hmm. I like your show. I got to go. <laughs> no. No, that's it. You feel? Okay. One oh. What did I you said, say? I like your show. Oh no, I hope the shoe is there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, oh, this is a big competitor. Okay, let's go. Okay, Matoke is sweet. Matoke is sweet. Matoke is sweet. No! <laughs> did I get it right? Did I get it right? Really? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I actually, now you don't know my token. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool, cool, cool. Okay, that's okay. too. Uh, okay, let's that's go. That's too old. So, um, my turn. <clears throat> I don't always sleep. I don't know what time it is. I don't always sleep. I don't want chapati. Last chance. I don't always sleep. I don't know the chapati. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm the winner. <laughs> what did you say? I don't always sleep. Ah, come on, come on, come on. Okay, the final mm -hmm. one. You're leading, but let's finish the drill. I thought you said it's straight. Okay. It's the third one. Okay. You have to lose one. Come on. Uh, well, you have to lose. It's not my fault that you lose. If you it. win this, okay. <sighs> Kopango. <laughs> Kopango. No, he can't get this. Kopango. Opako. <laughs> Kopango. That's one. Uh -huh. Can you say it again? Kopango. Go back home. And the last one? Kopango. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Kopango. 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 <laughs> I just want to teach Wait. him. You got that language. Wait, hold on. Say it one more time. I just want to teach him Ugandan language. I just want to teach him Ugandan language. He doesn't know this. Okay. Say it. Look at him. Say it one more time. Ko pa ngo. O pa ngo. Oh! Is that it? <laughs> Did I get it right? You got it. Really? Ko pa ngo. It's a Ugandan language saying, how are you? Ko pa ngo. <laughs> Ugandan language? What, what, what type is that? Like, it's actually. Actually, okay, because I know. Okay, I know, let me I know teach you. You say? Ogambachi. Aha. Uh -huh. Now, if I say. I know uh, Wasuzu. Uh -huh. Aha. Now, let me teach you this one. Uh -huh. If I say. Kopango. Huh? So, I got that right? You got it right. Cool. So, where's my prize? Big G.
Mm-hmm. Big J. <laughs> <laughs> so let me teach you now this. If okay. I say Kopango, you say Kope. Kopango. Kope. So Kopango. Kope. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> you now you can then. I'm going to give you a natural name. Okay. The natural name I'm giving him is Okot. <laughs> Okot. So your name is Okot. Okot. Okay, there's a Nigerian name Okotie. Okotie. So. Now I've given you because you know how to greet in a trail, you say Kopango, I've given you the name Okot. Okot. Ladies okay. and gentlemen. I'm here with Okot. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you very much for honoring our show and remember this is my star with Asa and remember to subscribe and tap on that notification bell whenever you can. But strictly before I close the show. We're going to give Obi Okwe just a few seconds to speak to us, tell us what we should expect this year from him, what is running around, and then he'll give us his social media handles so that we follow him and continue seeing what happens in his life. Off to you, bro. Oh, hello, everyone. Um, as I said, my name is King Sidi Obi Okwe. I'm Nigerian. Um, I'm very happy to be here. Thank you for having me. Uh, shout out to my family back in Nigeria, my friends. And uh, my new fan family here in Uganda, um, the Honorables team. Yeah. I really love you guys so much, like I do. Thanks for giving me the opportunity. And then, Bliz, um, it's 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 very wonderful working with Bliz, mm-hmm. Emma, Cora. It's you, you're you're amazing. You're awesome. Thank you so much. Yeah, I, I feel so um, so very much loved. You know, um, very accepted in Uganda and. Uh, I have a lot going on right now. I have an environmental project I'm working on. Just stay tuned. I'll give you all the information as it's rolling out. And um, okay. as for the entertainment industry, I have a lot, like a whole lot going on right now. It's on. beautiful. It's amazing. Just mm. watch out and uh, enjoy whatever it is that is coming from me because you will love it. You will really love it. As for my social media handles, mm-hmm. you can get me on Instagram at Kingston, on Twitter at Kingston5, excuse me, on Facebook, Kingston Obiokwe. Okay. Thank you so much. Follow me and I'll follow you back. All right. Look forward to seeing you very and soon. And what's the name I've given you? Okot. Okot. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. It has been very amazing. Don't forget our comment section is very active. Please put someone whom you want us to host next. But ladies and gentlemen, thank you for keeping on with the stars. My name is Angel Tony Asa, Prince of the Sun, and we've had Obio. Kwe, Obi Kingsley, Mr. <laughs> Okot. <laughs> this is my start. Ciao, adios, I'm done. Peace out. Peace.